Designing assessments that are authentic, current and relevant can engage students, spark their interest and discourage them from breaching academic integrity standards. Designing assessments that are work or community based provides authenticity. Other ways of ensuring authenticity include designing assessments across different modules or different cohorts. Keeping the topics of your assessment current, perhaps by linking them to current affairs or contemporary issues, is also good for helping to ensure good academic integrity. Let's look at how you might do this by taking DCU's virtual learning environment loop as an example. Updating the topic or subject matter of an assessment each year is an easy way to show students that your assessment is current and relevant. This also links to principle three. You could use the choice activity on loop to provide a list of current topics for students. They would select the current topic that speaks to them the most and then complete their assessment on it. On your loop course page, click turn editing on and click add an activity or resource and select choice. Use the name and description fields to give a title for this activity and instructions to students as to what they should do. There are a number of settings to be configured in the options area. You can allow students to change their selected option. I'm going to choose yes in this instance. You can also allow them to select more than one option if you wish. You can also limit the number of students who can select each option. When the limit is reached, then no one else can select that option. Adding a limit can be useful in motivating students to engage with the assessment and make their selection early before the limit is reached. You need to add at least one option to the choice activity. Enter the title of your option in the option one field. If you have chosen to set limits on your options, add in the number of students who can choose this option in the limit one field. Work your way through the option and limit fields on the screen. If you need to add more options, click the add three fields to the form button. In the availability area, you can restrict the amount of time available to students to make their selections. Again, this can be useful in motivating students to engage with the assessment early. In the results area, you can choose to keep the results hidden from students, show the results after they answer, show results after the time period has closed, if you configured that in the availability area, or you can always show results to students. Additionally, you can also allow students to see the full results or anonymous results. You can also use activity completion to deem the student to have completed the activity when they both view the choice and when they make a selection. Click save and return to course when finished. Students can now go into the choice activity and select a topic for their assessment that is current and relevant.